hi guys it's Peter so today I'd like to show you how I'm currently testing my ECG app you know then I already introduced to you this app is currently not for sale I'm using that for my own let's say purpose or <laughs> profit target and I develop certain I would say quite interesting concepts and systems within my ECG app right now and this session I'm testing the app using Casino Club and a practice mode but anyway it's the same random number generator like if you play with the money so it was a for me the first test how the app and the system will look like and will behave once you are really on a real table and playing with the random number generator not only testing and I would say this is audio command which I let's say record after that I play this test session and I would say even with this session you will see then I'm going through one time uh, let's say not successful progression but I'm using let's say relatively new concept how to play with the phantom bankroll and then within the session you will see then how let's say beneficial is that right so I like to explain you a little bit more detail if you want to hear that so I'm currently what you see here uh, it is the setup which is looking really good and great for me so far so I'm using spins 20 and one level so you know in the past normally I play like eight spins and three levels currently for me it looks like the best setup spins 20 one level progression aggressiveness let's say normal 3.6 percent so you are always winning whenever your number will hit and what is interesting I'm using variance from average this time number four so actually it's a little bit higher variance from average four means then I multiply my base bet once my progression is not successful but what is I would say quite interesting then I'm setting a phantom bank or land to number two so which means then if I'm going through the unsuccessful progression then using variance from average will multiply my base bet to four plus I will play with this multiplied base bet two times so normally if you if you remember phantom bankroll from the past it was like that so once you for example phantom bankroll was in minus so you were playing actually all the time with the increased base bet right which might be simply too long and therefore I'm saying I wanna let's say use higher variance from average and I wanna quickly recover from my let's say lost progression but I wanna do it just two times in a worst case then I would let's say play again 20 spins with already base bet 4 using balance from average and this would not be successful like two times in a row then the length would remain 2 but the base bet as well would be 4 not again multiplied and so on the, this way I want to really keep under control my base bet, my variance from average, my drawdown, all of this stuff. So I think it's quite smart setup for ma money management, which I'm currently using. And I'm really happy about that, especially from test as well. It looks great. And once you will see here in this session, it's also working quite well. I'm going through the 20 spins progression and no success. Then my base bet is multiplied. I actually win. And... I do not just immediately switch to let's say the basic or default base bet I still using the higher base bet for the second round because it's my phantom bankroll and it's two and I'm winning again with this 20 spins so I completely recovered from my lost progression so you just need in general if you are lucky enough just two more wins then you are fully recover or mostly recover from your lost progression so this is I think really great because in normal case you need maybe four five six winnings to be somehow recovered and, and so on so I think this is what I found out like this is a great money management feature plus uh, what I'm using like a system I'm using wave count and wavelength plus I'm calculating dynamically wavelength based on 
average column so average column actually is determining my wavelength and based on that I'm betting and receiving the predictions which for example four numbers to play and you will also see then for example pattern 6 16 26 36 I'm actually playing three times in a row very quickly because there was a simply momentum and momentum was determined by the average calculation and putting to wavelength and wave count it was still fulfilling my conditions so therefore I'm playing three times in a row more or less uh, this pattern and all the time I'm winning on that pattern so I think somehow finding the right momentum and betting on that it's quite cool feature which I developed with this average column and using wavelength and wave count plus what you can see here like additionally uh, you see something like swing conditions you see the last two columns from 1 to 20 and 21 to 40 and uh, swing conditions also you can say what will be the range it's currently it's not calculated in this session because I'm not, not using swing conditions this is one, one concept which I also added to my ECG app I'm testing this concept as well there are two options either I can also use dynamically calculated average and plus not only using this additional algorithms like number of hits and so on or I can just use a number of hits for this first 20 spins and an additional 20 spins and based on that I'm determining when is the best time to go and start betting this swing conditions is like additional feature or system which I'm currently testing but I think so far using this dynamically calculated average and using them for wave length and wave count later on so this is so far for me working really great and including this phantom bankroll setup like as I just explained to you it looks like really really promising concept so I actually I received a lot of questions whether this app would be available so far I do not plan to make it available on any web page I was considering maybe then I will let's say let release or offer uh, two copies uh, only worldwide so far uh, maybe if it would be interesting you can send me email and I can also you can discuss that as I said this this um, ECG app I developed just for myself so far uh, they are really quite unique concept I would say especially taking fun, phantom bankroll money management concept plus also this uh, using average dynamically calculated and using for wavelength and so on I think this is really one of the best feature how to simply see and touch the momentum of these five patterns which I'm using so as I said so if you like to be really interested in the app I'm considering to, to provide two copies worldwide not more so far so just send me email and we can discuss that of course so I would say you can watch the whole episode it's just 13 minutes but you will see as I said one time uh, lost the progression but also using variance from average using phantom bank Roland and it is actually working quite well the idea I think it's good one yes of course uh, here I'm using let's say base bet one and, and four later on when it is multiplied with variance from average but uh, this because of practice normally I would play with 20 40 cents so this is let's say safer but anyway you will see then I will almost create 200 euro profit just like that with a not really big drawdown especially if you consider like I have a drawdown something like 200 in total but I'm using a 1 euro base bet which is already high one big one so therefore I think it's quite interesting how the performance of this setup is and I can tell you I was also testing um, many thousands spins with this setup and many times after let's say 30 40 thousand random spins it was still in plus which I consider like very good one sometimes even more than thousand in plus so I think this this setup or something around this setup might be really key how how to compete with a random generator in sustainable way quite often so I would say thank you very much for watching this episode I hope that you will enjoy it and I'll be happy to see you next time and next time I, I guess I will already record the live session with real money and see how the ECG app will work thank you very much and see you next time bye bye